Hey, how are you doing? I'm Pastor Fred. This is the follow through and I want to ask you a weird question. Does your life preach? And I'm going to tell you, the answer is it does. And the better question might be, what does your life preach? Your life is a message to the people around you. It's, it's, it's a way of showing them what's important to you. Now, now, you can tell people what you say is important. You can tell people what, what Jesus means to you. You can say all of that, but what you're doing is, is really going to tell the story, isn't it? And it's awesome when those two line up, when you're like, my hope is in Christ and he gives me life and he gives me his love and I am you know, cared for every day by him. And every day, regardless of what you face, you live that out. And that's powerful. And that, and that has the, the, the power to, to impact somebody in your life. Now, now Peter, in, in 1 Peter, we're going to look at chapter 3, verse 1. Um, he's, he's kind of focusing down on a specific relationship, right? It's, uh, it's husbands and wives in this section. Now, today, uh, we're looking at, um, you know, with, with wives. And then tomorrow, I want you to come back because we're going to look at, uh, you know, Peter's going to talk about talk to husbands, right? So, so wives, I want to talk to you, and I, and I think this applies to all of us, uh, very, very much so. He, he says this. He says, "Likewise, wives, be subject to your own husbands, so that even if some do not obey the word, they may be won without a word by the conduct of their wives." Now, again, th- this is not saying not to tell your your husband or to tell your kids or to tell anybody the the truth about Jesus. Um, You know, there's that famous phrase, right? Preach the gospel, sometimes use words. Ah, We use words. That's not his point. He's saying is your life preaches so loudly and, and so powerfully and so persuasively by how you live and how you love that it's going to either reinforce what you said or, 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 or kind of point in a different direction, detract from it. So, so your life does matter. You are sort of this living example of what it means. And, 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 and what, what Peter hopes happens is that we're living in such a way, so wives, that, that your husband goes, man, so that's what Jesus is all about. So, so that's what it means to love, right? As they experience being loved by you, experience acceptance and care and, and concern and all of that that comes from your faith in Christ, right? And that's where the words become important because you let, let them know that that's where that source of strength is. That's where I'm getting this. That's why I love is Him. It's why I give. It's because of Him. And when that's followed up by like a life of love and, and, and sacrifice and commitment and, and, and above all, receiving that love from Jesus, right? That's incredible. And that'll preach every day, all right? So have a great rest of your day. Um, share this, hit that subscribe button, and we'll talk to you next time.